Are you a real estate agent and you're wondering, why do I need to start a Facebook group? I get leads from Zillow and open houses. Well, stay tuned because I'm going to tell you why you can leverage this free lead generation tool in your business that's guaranteed to get you leads and warm leads that want to work with you. Hi, my name is Laura Griffith. I'm a top selling real estate agent in the Northern Virginia area, and I'm also a real estate coach. And I help real estate agents start, grow, and leverage a Facebook group to get warm leads in their business. And so often I hear from agents, ah, you know, why do I need a Facebook group? I'm already doing online Zillow leads. I'm doing open houses. I'm doing door knocking. I'm calling Fizbo's and expired. I don't need one more thing in my life to generate business. Actually, you do. And I'm going to tell you why. First and foremost is you're going to get back money, okay? Facebook groups are free. And I know so many times people are, oh, I use Facebook. I've got a Facebook page. That's great. But the thing of it is, is people are not seeing the content that you're posting on your page, or maybe you're having to run ads to get engagement. A Facebook group is a tool that Facebook is now leveraging in their business, and they want to grow their groups. They want to build a sense of community around Facebook. And if your ICA is there, they are generally pushing your group content before they're going to push your page content. And I'm going to give you an example. The other day I was on my way to a listing appointment. It was the first Saturday of the month and my kids love to go to these Home Depot kids workshops, right? So they um, stopped, we did the little workshop and then I went to my listing appointment and I posted on my page, stopped at Home Depot. We made this cute little treasure chest. Isn't it adorable? And then I headed off to a listing appointment. Um, well, my kids finished up the activity with my husband. I posted the same post with the same picture in my Facebook group and on my page. My page, like 110 people saw it, was such dismal results. In my group, over 5,000 people saw it. So 5,000 people saw not only am I a mom, can they relate to me, running between kid activities to work, but they also have a real estate agent. It was a little sly way of sneaking it in there, right? Because I'm on my way to a listing appointment and I was dressed for it and I legitimately was going. Um, after we built the treasure chest, but it was a way for me to stay in front of my ICA. So as you can see, Facebook groups are, they're not only free, but you're gonna get more engagement and more traction. So, so often I hear agents say, I'm spending thousands of dollars per month on Zillow leads. Well, if you're spending three to $5,000 a month to get leads, to generate however much business you make, I'm gonna tell you a secret. I use my Facebook group to generate all my leads for my business. Some of it is referral from past clients, but I would say 90% of it comes from my groups. I'm going to tell you a secret. I generate over $22 million a year in sales. Last year I did over 22 million. The year before I did almost $21 million in sales from my Facebook group. And you know how much I spent? Zero. So the agents in my office, at no shame in their game, but they're spending three to $5,000 a month on Zillow leads and I'm spending nothing. So you may be six, spending $60,000 a year to get $20 million in sales. I'm spending zero money and I'm getting the same amount. So you can see having a Facebook group because it's free is going to help you in your business with generating leads without spending a ton of money. The other way that a Facebook group is so great is, are you like me where you're an outgoing introvert? Like I hate open houses. I hate doing it and I will not door knock. I don't like being dumped in the middle of a room. I feel awkward. I'm standing there. You have to have all these conversations with people. But when I'm on a Facebook group, I can have conversations with people back and forth because there's the screen is there. <laughs> and in my head, it's protecting me and I don't have to be, you know, so out there. And I can still network with hundreds and thousands of people in a day and in a week, but yet I'm not having to physically go anywhere. So not only is it helping my introvertedness, but it's also helping me because I'm not wasting every Saturday or Sunday doing an open house or going to all these networking events. You know what I'm doing on the weekends? Spending time with my kids. And that's more important to me in my business right now. But yet I'm still generating sales because I'm number four out of a thousand agents in my office. So I'm still able to generate and do the amount of business I want to do, but I have my weekends and nights back. So using a Facebook group is a great way if you don't want to give up your weekends or maybe you don't want to be going to every networking event or maybe the thought of door knocking just scares the heck out of you like it does for me, Facebook groups might be a good way for you to generate leads in your business. The next way that a Facebook group can really help you and when I hear agents like, oh, I don't know if it's the right thing for me, 
is you're building a sense of community and it's a great way to give back to your community. With my content plan that I teach in my course, I go over, there are different types of posts and some of the posts that you're gonna do is just community based. You're just gonna pour into your group. You're gonna provide value and not always just real estate. It's like, where's the cutest pumpkin patches? Where to go for apple picking? Where are the best holiday lights? Where's the best 4th of July fireworks? You're pouring into your group and you're giving value and you're turning yourself into your own little community town mayor or celebrity. I don't know how often I am at Target with my kids or just by myself and people stop me and go, oh, you're Laura, the Facebook group, and we start talking about real estate. Or just recently we went to a farmer's market in, um, in the neighborhood next door to us and some lady stopped me and she's like, you're Laura and that's Brayden, your son. I was like, yes, my son's like, oh, this is here we go again. And they wanted to talk to me about real estate. And you know what that turned into? They bought a $2 million house because she follows me in my Facebook group. How often was, I mean, how awesome is that, right? I'm out shopping, I looked a mess. I'm a hair been a messy bun, I wasn't really dressed. And she stops me and recognizes me and wants me to help her buy a house because they're renting. Super duper easy. So with a Facebook group, not only are you gonna save money, get some of your weekend and you know late night precious time back because I'm really only spending a few minutes a day in my group um, and I can help you with that but I'm also becoming a community expert and being a leader and a celebrity in my community. So if you're wondering about how to start a Facebook group and wondering if it's the right thing for you, down below I've got a link to my free webinar that explains everything that you need to know about starting a Facebook group. I also have a link to my course. If you're thinking about starting a Facebook group and you wanna jumpstart your sales for the next year and really kick off the first quarter of 2024 in a big way, then start um, then click the link below and you can start our course about everything that you need to know from Facebook groups, about how to set up your group, how to start your group, name it appropriately, provide content and have a content calendar, nurture the people and how to grow your group. Everything is in there that you're gonna need to know all about a Facebook group. If you have any questions about starting a Facebook group or how to leverage it in your business, my contact information is in the link below in the description.